Off the top at six tonight, we continue working breaking news. A police officer airlifted to the hospital after she was shot at a gun range. That officer was taking part in a training exercise when the unthinkable happened. And we have live team coverage for you tonight. Local 10's Christian Nella Rosa is at Jackson South with an update on her condition. But we begin with Roy Ramos live at the scene in Homestead. Roy. Nicole and Calvin, and since we last spoke with you at 5 o'clock, we've been able to gather new information from the Pinecrest Police Chief. We now know this was a female officer who was shot in the forearm by another female officer during this training exercise. And at this point, investigators believe this was accidental. Sky 10 up above the Homestead Training Center Wednesday afternoon after reports of an officer shot. Miami-Dade Fire Rescue arriving to the training grounds near Southwest 117th Avenue and 304th Street just before 3 to find a woman shot who we have learned is an officer with the Pinecrest Police Department. The department telling Local 10 the officer was at the facility for a pre-scheduled training exercise when the unexpected happened. Her injury, severe enough, we learned she was first transported to a local hospital in Homestead before then being airlifted to Jackson South, where she is now being treated. Back at the training facility, we watched as a number of agencies likely participating in training earlier in the day left the property. This, as investigators now work to find out what led up to that officer hit by gunfire in an area where safety is expected to be a top priority. And we have learned that this officer has been with the Pinecrest Police Department for four years. The Florida Department of Law Enforcement is now investigating as they do with any officer involved shooting. As for that officer who was shot, we're told that she is now in stable condition, but a very own Christian De La Rosa will have more on that. For now, here in Homestead, Roy Ramos, Local 10 okay, News. Okay, good segue to talk about that. Thanks a lot there, Roy. The officer was first rushed to Baptist Hospital Homestead. But she's now being treated at Jackson South. That's where Local 10's Christian De La Rosa continues our live team coverage. Christian. And that is because doctors determined this is where she needed to be treated. She was shot in the forearm, but all of this, everyone here knows, could have been so much worse. And so go ahead and take a look here as we witnessed and saw officer after officer showing up here to show their support to their sister in blue, everyone breathing a huge sigh of relief. Sky 10 over Jackson South as this officer arrived here airlifted. She was wheeled in, stabilized for her injuries. The chief of the Pinecrest Police Department speaking to us moments ago. She's in great condition. She's going to be just fine. That's the best news that we could have. She's in good spirits. She's surrounded by her family. And, you know, we're, we're, uh, we're dealing with it as a family, as a, a one Pinecrest. And, you know, everybody is a little shaken up today, but the good news is she's going to be just fine. I am extremely relieved. You know, the, you, know you get that call that no uh, chief ever wants to hear that one of your officers is shot, regardless of how it happened. You never want to hear that. Um, but I knew from pretty early on that it wasn't a very, very serious wound and she was going to be okay. So that was a big relief. Shaken up and relieved, but the chief telling us he has a lot of questions about this mishap and what exactly went wrong. Again, this officer is still not identified. She is in stable condition. She was shot in the forearm. She is expected to be here for at least several more hours, possibly overnight. We'll keep you posted. Live in Southwest Miami-Dade, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10 News.